put the bell tower environment into play ringing this comes in with two after venom activates again she move e or when venom activates again she move each uh, face on boost card on your identity venom is tough and steady when revealed search the encounter deck and discard power for tooth and nail and put it into play After you attack and damage Venom with a card you control, place one face down boost card on your identity. Anyways, love your stuff. You and Dale got me into Marvel Champions. Where's my $5? <laughs> I'm so happy. Thank you so very much, Carlo. I appreciate you. Um, ChatGPT says the pronunciation of is approximately Dor Raised Ton. Here's a breakdown. Sure, Amdrello. You said. Oh, I did. I did, didn't I? I'm running out of drink. <laughs> I'll need to get a refill. Need to get a refill. And we come in with 18 hit points on the villain, which I will not name. And Flash gets 12. Hydrate. Ah! <laughs> This comes in with eight. Oh wait, actually, I brought my water up here. Turns out drinking water is good for you. Oh. Awesome. Three more here. Let's do it. Oh, we're doing it. We're doing it. Okay, so these channel points I have no idea what, like I have like the emotes or whatever for channel points, water torture, <laughs> but like, does anyone have, or has anyone seen a good idea for like channel points? Where are you in NL? I'm not following. I'm sorry. NL, NL, NL. We got first aid, we got Groot, we got strength, we got welcome, welcome aboard, we got locked and loaded, and welcome aboard. Max one per round, so we're going to toss this, we're going to toss Groot, or we're going to toss first aid. Netherlands! Oh, oh, okay, okay, got it, got it, got it. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Thank you. I like it when people do predictions where you can bet your points, win or lose your games. Oh, interesting. D20 does channel points to pick villain or hero he plays. Okay. Okay. I'll write some of these down. We can reduce the cost of place status cards. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, reduce cost. That's cool. That's fun. Pick villain. That's fun. Cool. Yeah. I, I wanted to do like special emotes for. Yeah, I wanted to do special emotes, but. I, I think you can only unlock it for like one stream. And I was like, I don't want to do that. Symbiote suit. That's a dangerous play one and a nowhere. Jeez. Alrighty. Let's go. Okay. So you control one additional upgrade that has a restricted keyword. Arm and ready. Discard cards from the top of your deck until you discard a weapon upgrade and add that card to your hand. Multi-gun. Woo. Alrighty. So I don't think we need to play locked and loaded anymore. Strength for nowhere. Welcome aboard. No, mm, I want to get multi gun. Symbiote. I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it. Let's go get the symbiote suit. Turn one. 
That'd be wild. I don't think I should do that at all. Symbiote suit is so funny with... He just... Does he just get more symbiote? Yep. Can you do a Nick Fury with your channel points where the chat can be Nick Fury and use their channel points to send Nick Fury card into your game? Then he's That'd be fun. That'd be really cool. Symbiote. 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 <laughs> I wind up discarding half my deck, <laughs> but it could be cool and thematic watching your every move and stepping in when needed. That'd be fun. That'd be really cool. I kind of like that. Venom Hero is one of my favorites. Wouldn't mind an Eddie Brock. Dang it. Stop putting, stop putting the name of the hero into the chat. <laughs> I just autopilot read the chat. <laughs> Just have a bunch of cards that you can helicarrier into the game for points. That'd be fun. That'd be really fun. I feel like I feel bad if I don't play multi gun, right? I think that's the play. Multi gun, hang on to welcome aboard and play nowhere. Oh wait, actually, hold on. Because if we can get nowhere onto the table, then we can play Groot. We get to draw a card, but we still can't play Multi Gun. But we can hang on to Multi Gun, and we can hopefully draw into a double. That seems risky. We only have one double left in the deck, so probably not worth it. Is Groot or Multi Gun better? Hmm. Or add new encounters that's mid game. Woo! <laughs> no, no, you're totally fine. You're totally fine, Just Ray. I'm just messing with you. <laughs> Can I share a Discord server that is a group? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Control. Mold. Okay. All right. We'll go strength and locked and loaded. Ooh, actually, hold on. The other play here. The other play here is you can go nowhere. Locked and loaded to grab Venom's pistol. I don't want to toss multi gun though. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. So if we play locked and loaded to get a Venom's pistol, we have a Venom's pistol in our hand. We then can play Groot, which draws us a card, which allows us to play Venom's Pistol, and we have Multi-Gun still in our hand. I think that's probably the play. So if we go Strength for Nowhere. Wait, we can't do that yet, technically. So let's go Locked and Loaded to go grab a Venom's Pistol. Yeah, I did. I did deny living for games. I am not good at this game. <laughs> Or like the modular set, you have to remove the top card of your deck from the game. Oh, that would be mean. Ooh. <laughs> One. Shh, giant shh. Whew. I'm going to be so hydrated. Okay. We got, we got somebody's pistol in our hand now. We're going to flip up to... Hero form. <laughs> We're going to use strength to play nowhere. Welcome aboard symbiote suit to play Groot. Nowhere triggers to draw us a card to Guardians of the Galaxy. We'll drop a pistol. Port for two. We have multi gun. Good thing, yeah. <laughs> Good thing that's just water, one hundred percent. Groot. We're gonna hang out with Groot. We got side holster. Honorary X Men. Inspired one, two, three, four. TBE. I'm playing the same game right alongside you. That's fun. That's really fun. <laughs> that That's really fun. Venom's going to attack us for two plus a boost card. Let's go ahead and block with Groot. Two, four. 
We heal two, so we have two damage now. Then we have two encounter guards. Coffee hydrates and caffeinates, so you could drink coffee each time you say the word. I drank all my coffee. <laughs> Oh, we got under fire. Surge revealed the top card in the encounter deck. Wade Cole, teamwork. When revealed, searching counter deck and discard pile for a copy of the cybernetic enhancements attachment and attach it to Wade Cole. After the attachment and activates discard cybernetic enhancements. They cannot take damage. Uh oh. We got gang up. Yikes. Venom's going to attack us for two plus a boost. We're at 12. We're going to take it. Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Caught off guard. Discard an upgrade or support you control. Buy a pistol. Wow. So that was fun. I, I had a good time with that. <laughs> Who's. Dang it. Stop that. <laughs> At least you can kill Wade this turn. Yeah, yeah. That hurt. That hurt a lot. Okay. Um. Side holster inspired TBE to play multi gun. You can deal two damage to an enemy, choose a player, deal one damage to each minion engaged with that player, remove two threat from a scheme. Um play honorary X-Men. Get plus one hit point. Alright, this is honorary guardian. Oops. Wrong one. Wade Cole sounds like the most generic <laughs> creator wrestler name. <laughs> it does though. Lose to damage or pilot scheme, check and spend points to save you. Ooh. I do like how chat is wanting me to succeed and not trying to kill me. <laughs> um, we'll, we'll take out Wade Cole. We'll flip down to Alter Ego and stand up. Six cards, Yondu. Tom's implant, let's go. Run and gun. Genius. Genius. Laser blaster. And another comms implant. You got one. Then I was going to go two plus zero. Nice. You got two cards. Wade Cole, one step above <laughs> Joe's John Smith. <laughs> I mean, I would like to play some ill-time stuns. That's fair. We got an assault, which is going to surge into a biting retort. Venom activates against you. Each boost card turns face up, gets plus one. Dang it. Stop saying Venom, Nelson. Come on. The funny thing is, is like, I've been telling myself that I want to try and like read the cards out loud to, because I feel like I, throughout a stream, I'll miss four or five little things on cards. So I've been trying to like read each card as I play it so that it can like help trigger if I miss something. But that's really going against me now that I can't say the name here. Resolve this card's win revealed ability. Remove two time counters from the bell tower. If it's on its quiet side, take one damage. Take one. He scheme for three. That puts us at five. Or if you're steamrolling, give the villain a symbiote too. <laughs> at this rate, we know what the next pause in the stream will be for. <laughs> we do. <laughs> nice. Oh my gosh. We're getting rolled on. Swinging assault. Change to hear him for him. The villain attacks you. Venom. Okay, stop that. You could say V or Eddie Flash. I'm trying. I'm trying. I really am. Okay. Attacking us. We're going to block with Groot. It's going to be two, three. So we heal one. Or we heal two. Wow. I feel like we, we just got so many extra activations right there. Like, that was crazy. Okay. 
We have to get rid of tooth and nail. I feel like tooth and nail is absolutely rocking us right now. Um, we have five hit points. Do we want a probably comms implant on Yondu rather than laser blaster at this point? So if we go comms implant on Yondu, he's thwarting for three. We have Venom thwarting for one. Okay, so we're good. Okay, so Venom will thwart for one here. We're going to go Genius, Run and Gun, and Comms Implant to play Yondu. Nowhere will draw us into a Triskelion. We will use a Laser Blaster to play a Comms Implant on Yondu. Yandu will thwart for three, and multi-gun will remove two of the nail. Woo! We'll hang on to Treskelion. Let's stand up. Oh my gosh. This has been a tough start. We're oh, we lose. No, okay, so put this back. Take six from here. Wow. <laughs> Ignore the main. Who needs the main, right? Okay. Savage attack. Mansion. Rocket. Grasping tendrils. Ooh, tendrils maybe. Okay. One here. Venom's... The tower is flipped. You also take extra damage. I think so. The way that I'm reading it. I just drank like 40 milliliters of water because I couldn't say. Because I can't remember not to say a word. We'll block with Groot. You are stunned. And Groot survives. Nice. Nice. Two cards. Bone Breaker. After Bone Breaker engages you, take one indirect damage for each Reaver minion engaged with you. For whom the bell tolls, remove two chimed counters. If it's on its quiet side, take a damage. Down to down to three health. That's good. That's good. Who is the bad guy? One of those villains that scales crazy from normal to expert? Not not usually. <laughs> I don't think, right? I think the the hard part is you start with tooth and nail. Like, and I just haven't been able to thwart it down fast enough. I would like to play Treskelion, but I also would like to play Mansion. Mansion allows me to play Treskelion earlier. Mansion doesn't really do anything for me right now. I have to get rid of Bone Breaker. I have to get rid of Tooth and Nail. He does get retaliated in Stage 3. And then also in Stage 3, the first time you damage him, you place two boost cards on your identity. Okay, let's go Mansion, Tendrils, and Savage Attack to play Rocket. Yandu will attack Bonebreaker for one. Rocket will take out Bonebreaker. Multi-gun for two. I 
don't think we can roll down. So two here. Puts us at four. I'm going to attack to remove the stun just so I don't take damage if I'm already stunned. Flesh and bio man is struggling against this game against evil bad demon dude. <laughs> I think uh, the hard part about this villain is understanding when to attack him so you didn't get one shot from boost. Yep. Not trolling, but avoiding you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. The bell tower was the real villain all along. <laughs> the friends were the ones we made along the way. Stand up. We're going to hang on to Treskelion yet again. Team training. Nice. Comms. One, two, three. Clarity of purpose is four. I forgot about my symbiotic bond ability. I'm going to take a damage and play Treskelion. I don't know how or why I forgot about that. One, two, three, four, five. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, add one. Batty is going to attack. We're going to block with Groot again. Two, Enraged Symbiote into play. We heal two. Sweet. Enraged Symbiote is attacking, which we will defend. Counter card, Skull Buster. After Skull Buster engages, you place one threat on the main for each Reaver minion. And Biting. Venom activates against you. I said it again. Uh, each boost card. We've gotten so many additional activations. It's crazy. I think here we have to chump with Rocket, right? We have to chump. We have to. Toss Rocket in the front. Two. Plus three. Alrighty. Can't wait for Carnage and Eddie Brock so we can... <laughs> a red one and go to alternate. <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh my gosh. Let's use comms implant to play endurance to give us plus three. One, two, three. Takes us up to five. I feel like getting called for backup is so good. Team training for call for backup. We'll take a damage using our ability to play clarity of purpose. Yandu is going to thwart call for backup. We're going to go get Beta Ray Bill. After Beta Ray Bill attacks and defeats a minion, remove two threat from the main scheme. We're going to multi-gun two here, and then Beta Ray is going to take out Skullbuster, which will remove two. Patrol means you cannot thwart. This is not a thwart. Then that's not a guardian. So I wonder if honorary guardian was supposed to be for beta ray bill. It definitely was. It definitely was supposed to be for beta ray bill. Oops. Here we are. Let's go ahead and stand up. Laser blaster. Reinforced suit. Savage attack. Carnage would be an awesome villain in this game. Yeah. Two, four, five. Venom's pistol. Okay. 
add one. Okay. Venom is attacking us. I think I'm going to Grasping Tendrils this attack. Um, we're at four health. I would like to get Yandu a Laser Blaster. I would like to get Groot a Reinforced Suit, which means that we're passing on the pistol. Or we can take a damage... Is that enough? We, we, we don't have enough to pay for everything, though. Uh, no, because we can Symbiotic Bond again. We'll take a damage. Savage Attack, Grasping Tendrils. When the villain initiates an attack against you, cancel that attack. If you pay for this card using only physical resources, stun the villain. Nice. Okay, so halfway stunned there. And this is our hand. Enraged Symbiote is going to attack. We will block with Groot and we will heal. Encounter cards? I have to get rid of Tooth and Nail. Another Symbiote. And uh, when reveal a searching encounter deck and discard power for a copy of the Cybernetic Enhancements and attach it to Murray. Cybernetic Enhancements. They cannot take damage. A lot of minions here. Okay. We're at three. We're at three. That's fine. Okay. Let's have Beta Ray take out the symbiote. Which will remove two threat from the main. Let's use, we have three health. What's the worst that could happen, right? Clarity, take a damage to play a laser blaster on Yandu. It would also be nice to get Reinforced Suit on Yondu. So many enraged about Might as well pull Shadows, right? <laughs> Dude, everyone give Nelson points to cast Dive Bomb from outside the game. <laughs> that'd be that'd be that'd be welcome and at this situation. Um, okay. We have Yandu has one health left. So I'm I'm thinking there's a couple of options that I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about throwing a reinforced suit on Yandu. I'm thinking about throwing a reinforced suit on Groot. Um we can do that by taking a damage and playing, and then we can hang on to Venom's pistol. If we do that, then we can get rid of tooth and nail. We have to do that, I think, right? We're going to flip down. There's a good, decent chance that we lose the main, or that we lose. But I think we have to be... I don't like... We'll heal when we flip down. Have we seen Project Rebirth? Was that one of the cards that... Yeah, that's one of the cards we flipped. We're getting our guns. We'll take a damage to play Reinforced Suit on Yandu. I feel like I'm playing a very reactive game here. We will thwart and multi-gun to take out Tooth and Nail. Get rid of that. Whew. Vision is better. Vision is better. I set up ability does more harm than good, in your opinion. <laughs> yeah. Um, flip and heal for four. One, two, three, four. We're going to hang on to the pistol and hopefully not lose. Stand up. We got pistol, welcome aboard, run and gun, 
Power of leadership. Two, four, five. Behind enemy lines. Give me a... Give me a... Ah, we don't get a... Mm. I was really hoping for a ally with welcome aboard, but here we are. Let's add one. Venom's said it again. <laughs> uh, scheming for four, five, six. That's game. That was tough. That was tough. Okay, so what I think I'm going to do is I'm already, we're already three hours into the stream, which is a lot longer than I thought. So we're going to go ahead and do – we're going to run this back, and that's going to be probably it for today just because I do have something that I don't want to be late to. Um, so we'll run this game back, and then we'll do more giveaways, and we'll try it again. Yeah. Each time, okay, each time I say the word, I have to spin the wheel. Would White Fox and Digging Deep trigger during the search for weapons? It does not because responses are not active during setup. No, it they, they don't. Responses are not active during setup, unfortunately. I think it was real no. Yep, yep. During the setup phase. Okay, let's try this again. Let's try this again. Oh, thank you so very much for the subscription. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's try this again. Okay. Good thing is, is we don't have a lot of setup to do. Yeah, Flash's setup can be harsh. I once ran through my whole deck and got an acceleration token before I took my first turn because that all is weapons after... Oh. What's nice about this deck is that there are additional weapons in it. Although I don't know why we have side holster. Brant, are you still here? Why do we have side holster in this deck? Thank you. Because I don't think that there is another weapon in here. Supposed to, oh, supposed to be sidearm. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. That makes way more sense. Thank you. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Cool. Sidearm. Sweet. Okay. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. Okay. We got this. We got this. Let's go. Okay. How's your game going, Brant? Did it go better than mine? <laughs> I think tooth, tooth and Nail seems to be like we have to just really focus on that. Okay, we'll shuffle this up. We'll also put me back up to 12. We don't have to adjust the villain's hit points, so that's good. This is really hard. I'm still alive. Good, 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 good. Yeah, I think this is... Yeah, this is uh, it's a tough matchup. My board is so hard to manage. <laughs> awesome. I believe in the heart of the cards. My grandfather's deck has no bad cards. Perfect. Okay, let's do it. Whew. I consider this a fun deck. <laughs> Quotes around fun. Honorary Guardian is there for Beta Ray build, correct? You might get a kick out of this, Nelson. With 10 minutes of becoming a member of your YouTube channel, I found a local group um, through one of your other viewers to play. Oh, really? That's awesome. That's so much fun. Yay. Good, 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 good. Oh, I'm so happy. Local, local groups are so great. That's fun. Good. Do you have a time when you're going to play? In a minor city in the Netherlands of all places. Oh my gosh. That's so... Yay. That's so... That's awesome. That's so much fun. Fun. You got somebody else who... Not doing that again. <laughs> or not doing that. Team training. Grasping tendrils. Power in all of us. Treskelion and laser blaster. Um, Tough.
No symbiote suit, no grasping tendrils, no laser blaster. This this is a tough call here. By the way, love the stream. Need to look into that, Carlo. Because would love a local group for Marvel Champions or heck any board games. Just Ray, yeah. Sup, Roland Reggie. How's it going? How you doing? Okay. Um I'm going to toss Treskelion. I think Treskelion is nice, but we have Nowhere that we can play. Nowhere increases our ally limit, assuming that we don't play beta. But we can also determine when we play beta or rebuild using Call for Backup. Rip somebody else. <laughs> uh, we're playing as, I'm not allowed to say the word, Flash. We're playing as Flash. Could he use power? I know, I know. But like then we're revolving three encounter guards. I think we just lose. Just played War Machine with Shield Justice cards. Felt open. Nice. Honorary Guardians for Beta Ray. Okay. Okay. We're going to toss Treskelly. Hey, good morning. What do we got? We got First Aid. That does not help. Behind Enemy Lines. Honorary Guardian. Running Gun. Ugh. Not a great start. Discard until we get... A weapon, which is multi-gun. Okay. At least we start with multi-gun. Just handle the cards. You're... <sighs> agent 13, field agent. I love that deck. I posted... I, 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 I played that deck at one point, and it's so much fun. It's just so stupid and fun. <laughs> All righty. Let's do it. I'm not going to forget my ability this time either. Yeah. Nice. It's a fun deck. It's a fun deck. I need to retry War Machine. Didn't really gel. He he. I think War Machine has gotten better, but I do think that War Machine leaves some to be desired. He's not. He's definitely not my favorite hero at all. V V V. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Okay. Let's flip to hero mode. Almost got me. Okay, so we can play behind enemy lines. Honestly, we may use our ability to play behind enemy lines. And then we can hang on to power in all of us. Multi-gun gets played. I think I'm good with that. Let's use a our ability. And first aid to play behind enemy lines. Remove three threat from a scheme. And confuse Venom. I guess half confuse. Actually, I would say that... The jump from standard to expert is significant because you start with steady versus not starting with steady on standard. Thought that combo didn't work since munitions need alter ego and field agent is hero. Yes, you're right. Did not go well. <laughs> I did the pub meeple ranking and war machine ended up being your least favorite. I really need nice. Yeah. So nice on doing the pub meeple. How, what was your top? I love Hawkeye shield bouncing mockingbird every round. The triggers sky destroyer is so satisfying. That's cool. Yeah. I, so the, the video is posted now. I did a deck factory video for sneak attack and my build is Hawkeye and doing that each turn, but I'm, I'm excited. I'm going to do a, a two-handed play with it. Wait, who's the... I thought Nelson... This was a Flash versus Eddie on a Bell Tower match. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's exactly what it is. Okay. Honorary running gun and... Where do we keep team training? Would I rather keep team training or I'm going to keep team training to play multi-gun? We'll take three off of two thin mail. We'll stand up. Savage. Yondu. Three. Four. Five. 
Locked and loaded. Interesting. Okay. I always wanted to make sneak attack deck, but it never felt good to play. Yeah, so the um on the Discord we do like Death Factory where I we pick a card that doesn't get a lot of love and then we try and build around that card just to kind of build some fun decks and everything. And so I did it as a video form and I I think so far it's been fairly decent decently well received. And so sneak attack is that card. So Top five from first to fifth was X-23, Cyclops, Spider, Ghost Spider, Spider Woman. Nice. Yeah, that's a lot of spiders. That's fun. Speaking of sneak attack, Marvel Champions doesn't have the Lord of the Rings broken equivalent of sneak attack. No, unfortunately. You can sneak attack uh, Nick, which is part of the, the Hawkeye deck, which is fun. All right, let's add one. I'm going to get attacked. Right, we'll take it. Two. Uh, remove two, try encounters, take one damage. One, two. Two cards. Donald Pierce. After engages, you reveal the topmost Reaver minion from the discard pile. There are none. And swinging as ult. The villain attacks you. One additional boost card. Getting attacked for two. We're going to block. Three. Four. So we take two. After Venom... After the... Uh, the villain takes any amount of damage from an attack. Remove one rage counter from here. Got him. Only have one health and no allies. Jeez. Nice. Reavers is a mean. All right. Let's do our ability. Take a damage locked and loaded behind enemy lines to remove three threats from the main and confuse venom. Okay. Multi gun will take out tooth and nail. Savage attack Yondu for team training. We'll flip down. Stand up. Reaver's top five hardest modular sets in your opinion. Yeah. Yeah. The steady is the really hard part. Confusing and flipping to build, draw, heal really powers the set. Yeah. Minions names are really in the Kingpin's random <laughs> Donald Pierce. Yeah. I don't think we're doing expert when I suggested. Re <laughs> well, that's kind of exciting. Nowhere. Call for backup. Nice. Genius. Run and gun. Welcome aboard. So many resources. Ah ha ha. Got one here. Donald scheming for two. I feel much better now that we don't have tooth and nail though. And shadows. Good. Uh oh. Okay. Well, that's coming in. Threat cannot be removed while a symbiote enemy is in play. So threat cannot be removed. One, two, three. <laughs> Here we are. It's happening, team. Ouch. <laughs> it's like the symbiote too without the benefits. <laughs> Alrighty. We'll flip up to hero form. Multi gun should be ready. We're going to deal one damage to everyone. Then we are going to use Welcome Aboard and Genius to run and gun. Or actually, Venom is going to deal two damage to Donald. Then we'll run and gun, ready Venom. I keep saying it. 
and each weapon upgrade. And then we will do it again. That's going to take out all of the symbiotes. Okay. It's like... <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> exactly what happened on your match. What's up, long-time viewer? First time catching the stream. Hey, how's it going, Noah? I'm glad you're here. Nice. Welcome to the stream. That's exciting. Let's go strength to play nowhere. We're going to attack to take out Donald. Take a damage. Play call for backup. But I think we lose. I think we lose to Venom. This is a tough match. Is Acolytes harder than Reavers? I don't think so. I think Reavers is tough. I think when I play Strange with uh, Gandalf instant transmission in his backup. <laughs> this is nuts. This is tough. This is tough. I think we lose probably. We'll see. But we probably should not have used our ability there to play call for backup. But here we go. Sidearm. Where are my allies? TBE, Laser Blaster, Comms, one, two, three, four, and Mansion. I'll add one. We're getting attacked for three. We'll block. We have one health. One, two, three. Two encounter cards. Venom, yep, Venom kills me. Okay, we're going to try it one more time. I think Reavers is much harder. Yeah, yeah, Re I think Reavers are harder. Okay. There's so many activations. This is it's also a tough matchup because like we don't really want to be chump blocking with the the allies that we get out. Yeah, they it's it's tough. It's tough. We have not even removed the tough in two games. Am I bad at this game? We'll do, we'll try one more time. Whoever suggested this, this is a, this is a good matchup. VVV. I think if we can, I think getting Groot out was really good because Groot can survive a couple of attacks from the villain. Jump up to 12. Okay. Okay. Also, after this game, you might say that the enemy has been tough to beat. <laughs> nice. <laughs> after this, we're going to do the another giveaway. So if you have not entered the giveaway yet this stream, go ahead and do so. If you're on Twitch, you can use the, uh, the command giveaway. If you are on YouTube, it's going to be in the video description. Just scroll down a little bit. And if you have already entered, you do not need to enter again. So go ahead and do that because after this game, we're going to spend... And the way that we do it is we'll spin until we hit three or until we hit someone who is not on the stream, whichever one comes later. So, but I'm bum. <laughs> I think Reavers can be removed from this game. We don't need Wade. <laughs> Wade makes somebody. Okay, so if we take Reavers out, do we want to throw Acolytes in? I feel like that's a fun swap. Reavers for Acolytes. Two, four, six, eight. That being said, I think I there was another game a couple streams ago where we ended up taking Reavers out. So now I kind of want to play Reavers. And get Reavers and like build for Reavers. Maybe I'll do that for my 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 two-handed game that I'm gonna film later today. I'll probably do that. They were in Logan. Okay. Reavers are so weird. I'm I'm uh weird because they're so difficult. Yeah, no, I have no idea who they are. Yeah. I, I don't remember them and I don't remember Logan like at all, actually. Okay. Let's do this. Let's let's win, team. Let's win. Okay. Sweet. Got two, four, six. 
The main antagonist in Logan. All right, nice. Blaze of Glory, Guardians of the Galaxy. That's a nice card. Groot is a nice card. Comms and Plant, Project Rebirth, and Nowhere. Oh my gosh, all of the cards that I want to pro. Definitely play Project Rebirth because that pays for itself, or it half pays for itself on turn one. After you play an upgrade on an ally, draw a card for Guardians. Nowhere is really decent. Oh my gosh. The ones who are hunting down X-23. They just look so mid, but apparently duel with Barrett 50 cals with <laughs> explosive. <laughs> I need to rewatch Logan, which I'm 100% okay with. I'll do that too. I need I need to do that because I remember nothing about that movie. Or at least going to toss those. Okay. We're also going to have a weapon to play. I think I hang on to Groot. I think I toss nowhere. Toss nowhere. We'll go three here. Inspired. Symbiote suit. Jeez. First aid. All right. We'll discard. Do we get a weapon? Okay, let's use Symbiote Suit to play Rebirth. We'll use Rebirth to draw a card. Give me a double sidearm. Dang. Logan is a great movie. Movie was a bit too serious for them to be like, oh, no, it's the Rebirth. <laughs> okay, we will flip up to Hero Form. Inspired and Sidearm. We'll play Groot. Oh, wait, Inspired Sidearm, Damage. We'll play Groot. First Aid, Laser Blast, we'll play Guardians. Um, Thor one off to the nail. Starting out strong. Welcome aboard. That's what I needed. Multi-gun. Now I'm not going to have any allies. Laser Blaster. There is Gamora. Okay, 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 okay. That's nice. That's nice. We got one here. We're going to get attacked for two. We'll block with Groot. Plus three. Of course it is. Take five. We heal two. Got two encounter cards. Strong start. Let's see that stop. <laughs> Shadows of the past now, right? Oh my gosh. Thank you for becoming a member. I need to... Justin, thank you so very much for joining the channel i appreciate you thank you thank you ah y'all are amazing uh first card is amelia when defeated the player defeated amelia is confused and venom activates against again another one we'll take this one two four one two three four okay all right okay okay we got this. We got this. <laughs> I'm going to go welcome aboard and our ability to play Gamora. Let's go. I hate dropping multi-gun or call for backup, but let's go call for backup to play Laser Blaster, which will draw us a card to Power of Leadership. Does not help. Um, Gamora will attack for three here. And we'll discard until we get a event. Uh-oh. Locked and loaded. Okay. Sweet. So we can play multi-gun if we flip down. We'll take out Amelia. We're confused.
flip down. Draw a card. We'll toss. Wait, actually, hold on. If I pretend I didn't know that. Because I could play lock and load to go grab Venom's pistol. Then we don't run the risk of losing. I think I already kind of did that. So we'll just do this and play multi-gun. Woo! Speaking of Guardians, any way to play the Guardians of the Galaxy game? It seems really awesome in your opinion. And it's pretty underrated. Just a heads up, it's free on Epic Games Store on PC. I don't... I have not heard of that game. What 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 type of game is it? Okay, let's stand up. We got strength, mansion. Oh, I like that combo. Beta ray. I love strength energy mansion. Genius. Oh my gosh. And inspired. That's six health. Add one. Venom is gonna scheme for Take a damage, so two total. Kind of storytelling, but it's so good. Actually, no one, interesting. It got kind of swept under the radar because it released after the Avengers game and uh, that did not do well. <laughs> Swinging Assault, change to hero form. We're getting attacked. I did not want to be in hero form. Let's block with Groot. Enough to take out Groot. Then we've got a King Up. Jeez. Uh, We're getting absolutely just... Venom is vicious. Ooh. Excellent music. Nice action scenes. Nice. Got a, I got it a long time ago. Kids play it, but I haven't been able to play it yet. It looks really good. Nice. Okay, we're getting attacked for... We're going to block. It's going to be two. We take a damage. Because of for whom the bell tolls. We are angry. Yeah. Yeah, We now we're angry to a whole nother level. Yikes. Yikes. Okay, well, let's go... Strength energy to play Mansion. Mansion will draw us a card into Rocket. Alrighty. We will take a damage and play Inspired on Gamora. And Gamora will thwart two here. We'll discard until we get a event, which is Grasping Tendrils. Genius and Tendrils will play Rocket. Oof, Avengers. That game needed was to be an Ultimate Alliance X-Men Legend reboot, and it could have been so awesome. It said it's a, a looter shooter grindy akin to Destiny. Really? That's a weird... That's weird. Huh. It's amazing how much a mod changes the difficulty. Yeah. Yeah. It really is. It really is. We're going to take four off of the main. We have Beta Ray, which we will toss. We're going to flip down again. Project Rebirth will heal us three. One, two, three. Stand up. Whew. Welcome aboard. Spider Sense. Nice. Okay. Honorary Guardian. Behind enemy lines. Comms. Two, four, five. Nice. I don't think I drew a card when I played Inspired. One more card. Power on all of us. Nice. We got one. We're going to get schemed upon for two, four. Takes us to seven. Not in advance. Not in advance. Fabian, when defeated, we discard cards so bad things happen. And lashing out. After Venom takes any amount of damage from an attack, remove an equal amount of threat here. Does that actually, does that also work for, does Tooth and Nail work for my? Can I trigger the tooth and nail response whenever my hero takes damage? That's interesting. I don't ever think I even thought about that. But it does say after Venom takes any amount of damage from an attack, remove an equal amount of threat from here. 
So I think so. Alrighty. Let's go mansion to draw a card. Endurance. Red six. Rebirth to draw a card. Running gun. Alrighty, nice. I believe the name is the same. It resolves for the character whose card. Oh, okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Different Venom would think it'd play like the different Spider Man allies. I guess it would definitely not intended, though. <laughs> I feel like there's a ruling about. It feels like something that someone has asked before. <laughs> for sure. I would love to be able to heal Gamora. I don't want to lose Gamora here. I also don't have any allies. Um, we'll flip up to Venom. Oh, sweet. Let's go... Um, Honorary Guardian to play comms and plants on Gamora. It's going to draw us a card from Guardians of the Galaxy, which is Grasping Tendrils. So now we have three Thwart and four Attack with Overkill. Actually, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. I have them on Xbox Series X for the Xbox Store. They are backwards compatible from the 360. Got it. Okay. Alrighty. Um, we do have a running gun. Let's use. Let's thwart. Move confused. Multi gun. We'll take two from. Mm, Gamora has three thwart. So, yeah, we'll take two from here. Um, Gamora will thwart here. She'll clear tooth and nail. We'll discard until we get an event, which is another running gun. Interesting. That could be, that could be, hmm. I don't know if that, I don't know how worth it that is. Let's go Rocket to take out Fabian. When defeated, we discard cards between counter deck until an Acolyte minion is discarded. Retaliate one teamwork. Discard each stun and confused status card from the villain and give it a face down boost card when defeated. Don't have any of my attachments either. Um, I feel like a running gun here is nice, but we also need to take care of the main, which we can do with. Oh, I want to play mm, use power in all of us and our ability to take a damage to play behind enemy lines. Move three threat from here. And half confused venom. Hate Fabian. Yeah, Fabian sucks. Tooth and tooth and claw gone is huge. Both advances and shadows gone. This match is looking better for sure. Yeah, totally. Fabian is my least favorite. His ability just causes me so much pain. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fabian helped avoid those at least six health retaliate minion is so rude. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. I thought about playing running gun, but now that I'm looking at it, I think I may... Hang on to Grasping Tendrils. Spider Sense, Rocket, Endur and play Spider Sense and Endurance. 
we have grasping tendrils, which we don't have to. Hmm. Or we don't get rid of grasping tendrils. We initiate the attack. We draw a card. We chump with rocket and then we block that. I think that's what I'd rather do. I don't know what I want to hang on to. How many allies did we put in this deck? I don't remember. We have five allies there. I think that actually may be all the allies. We may not draw into an ally. Um, oh, wait, oh, it's Discord. Yeah, we only have five allies. So we're not hitting the allies as much. As, or we're not going to hit an ally. So we don't need to hang on to welcome aboard. Maybe we just hang on to a running gun. Because we also haven't seen any of the pistols. Right? So we're going to be drawing into two pistols probably. So let's hang on to a running gun. We're going to get super uber efficient out of that. And then we'll we'll lose rocket and that'll be fine. Okay. Welcome aboard to play Endurance. That's going to give us three health. One, two, three. We're going to go Grasping Tendrils, Running Gun to play Spider Sense. We're going to hang on to Running Gun. Okay. He's killed me so many times against my... Yeah. Whew. Okay. Stand up. That's gone, which is nice. This is here, though. Do we also have a first aid? Yeah, Treskelion. We've seen the first... I think first aid was in our opening hand. Was it not? It wasn't. Oh, there it is, though. Okay. So a team training... We also passed on that, didn't we? Yeah. Okay. So Gamora, we either need to have her take an attack. There's one of the pistols. There's a second pistol. One, two, three, four, five. The other thing is we could... No, it's not worth it. Okay. Go two here. We're getting attacked. We're going to block with rocket. It's enough to take Rocket out. We'll take the two from Delgado. Our encounter card is a Symbiote. Okay. That's fine. Ooh. Okay. 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 Oh, and we get to draw a card from Spider Sense, which is Clarity of Purpose. Don't... <laughs> I could play Clarity of Purpose on Gamora and it would technically trigger Guardians of the Galaxy, which is fun. Mansion is going to draw us into behind enemy lines. That's That would full confuse Venom. That is, I think, worth it. Let's knock out Enraged Symbiote. Comms Implant. And our ability to play behind enemy lines to remove three threat and confuse. Okay, okay, okay. Running gun, we'll play pistol. Clarity, we'll... Tress Kelly and we'll play Clarity. Clarity will play Pistol. Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use Multi Gun and then I'm going to thwart for three here with Venom's basic activation rather than attacking. Okay. At this point, we will flip down and use Rebirth to heal for three. One, two, three. Stand up. Okay. Savage attack. Reinforced suit. There's that reinforced suit for Gamora, which could be huge. That would be a really nice drop on Gamora. Nice. Okay. 
Savage Attack, welcome aboard. Give me an ally. One, two, three, four. Nowhere. Laser Blaster. We got two card draws. Always nice to get Project Rebirth super early. Yes. Yes. We got two. Confuse. Delgado is scheming for one. We got two cards. The first one is an Enraged Symbiote. The next one is Unstable Sentience. Give the villain one face down boost card and it surges. And two. Venom activates against you. Gets plus one. So it's going to be two, three, four, five, six. We didn't lose. So that's nice. We're at nine. Ugh. Shuffle each Acolyte uh, minion in the discard pile back into the encounter deck. Gross. That's such a tough boost effect. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, he does need to chill. Rebirth is great. I like how it mirrors Aunt Peter's Aunt May. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cool how they have similar. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. We didn't lose. Mansion will draw us into Treskelion. I really... I really want an ally right now. Rebirth will draw us into behind enemy lines. Okay. Let's flip up to Venom. That Shuffle Acolyte boost always magically shows up when Magneto's deck is like two cards. Yeah, right? Yep. He's Avenging Mojo. That's so true. Yeah, he is Avenging Mojo. We don't... Okay, we'll use a Laser Blaster to play a Reinforced Suit on Gamora. Which will draw us into Grasping Tendrils. Wait. No, not Sidearm. I don't want to use Sidearm. Um, I want to use Laser Blaster. That's what I wanted to do. Okay. We will Clarity take a damage to play Sidearm on Gamora, which will draw us into Beta Ray Bill. That's nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Go Welcome Aboard, Savage Attack. That's three. Four damage for our ability. For five to play Beta Ray Bill. We lose this ability, but here we are. Beta is going to take out the symbiote, which will take two here. And those two cards are the bubble and wrap. Yep, always, always. <laughs> um,. Okay, so I can thwart for three off the main. We're going to go Treskelion behind enemy lines to play nowhere. I can I can take out Delgado. Yeah, let's do that. Multi-gun for two on Delgado. We will attack for four to take out Delgado. We need to get him out of there, knowing that we're about to hit a ton of Acolyte minions. This comment triggered my fight or flight response. <laughs> nice. Um, and Gamora will thwart for... She has one, two, three. So three total off of the main. And I guess uh, I should have... I did that out of order. So we're at seven, so we go down to four. I should have done... I should have thwarted first. Because now we're going to discard until we get an event, which is Blades of Glory. That's fine. Okay. Let's stand up. 
We're going to toss Blaze of Glory. We have five health, but we can block with Venom's Pistols and be fairly okay with that. We got first aid. That's huge for us right now. Genius. Behind enemy lines is also a really nice inspired. We can inspire beta ray bill. Two, four. I'm looking for honorary guardian. That'd be great. Comms implants. Okay. Maybe we can draw into it. Throw two here. Do it. <laughs> okay, we got two. Venom's going to attack us for two plus a boost card. We will defend for four. Plus one. We take no damage. Our encounter card is under fire. Surge reveal. Regardless, I'm always going to be. I'm always going to be resolving two encounter cards. That's what I've realized. Doing pub meeple and have to pick between Drax or Gambit. Ooh, there's Fabian. And now we're angry. Uh, he gains overkill. Our turn. Mansion will draw us into the power in all of us. Gamora is ready. Let's use... How much health? We have five health. We don't... Oh, we do have an Inspired on Gamora already. Let's use inspire, our comms implant to play Inspired on Beta Ray Bill. That's going to give us plus one attack. And then Beta Ray Bill will attack and take out Fabian, which will trigger this response to remove two, and then we'll discard until we get a Acolyte. Unisone comes in with toughness. Give the villain a tough status card. If the villain already has a tough status card, heal four damage from it. Also, I think I missed giving the v Venom a tough status card when I killed Delgado, but I won't tell anyone if you don't. I think we have to start hitting the bell. It's impossible to break Venom's tough because these minions just keep appearing every turn, and he's he'll bring he's bringing friends. Hitting the bell is. I'm scared to hit the bell. <laughs> None of these give us piercing, right? Not just ranged. <laughs> yeah, it's Venom. I kind of, I think the the word ban is technically for like five minutes, and so like I was spending, I need more of my brain space to try and figure this out. <laughs> but yes, I will drink for that. I'm out of water. I drink forty mil or I drink uh, forty ounces of water. So so here we are. Um. <laughs> We'll use the power on all of us to play first aid on Gamora. I'm honestly a little afraid to trigger Gamora's ability because I don't want to discard any of my allies. Nope. I have not been drawing off spider since. Good catch. Thank you so very much. I will try and remember that from now on. Also, I, I can't risk not drawing Otter or Guardian, I don't think. I have to take out Unison though. So let's go ahead and multi gun to knock the tough here. And then Gamora will attack. Take out Unison, which is giving the villain a tough status card. Heal four damage. None of that matters. Then we will behind the enemy lines with a genius to remove three threat from the main. And half confuse Venom. Okay. Okay. Pouring myself a glass of water right now for the cause. I appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> Let's stand up. Okay. TBE, Yondu, comms implants, team training. I would, yeah. Welcome aboard. Two, four, five. Okay. That two. Venom's attacking. We'll initiate. We'll draw into Honorary Guardian. There it is. Nice. Okay. But yeah, we would have... No, we would have gotten Welcome Aboard, which would have been nothing. Okay. 
Let's defend for four. Attacking for three, four, five. We take a damage. That's still there. Our encounter card is Sinyaka. Uh, the player defeated Sinyaka is stunned. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Let's go mansion to draw into rocket. That's interesting. Go honorary guardian on beta ray bill, which turns on all of our team cards again. Welcome aboard. Oh, I don't want to take damage. Ugh. Welcome aboard and Yandu are going to play Rocket. Nowhere will trigger to draw us a card into Symbiote Suit. That seems dangerous. Um, I think I would rather have the Beta Ray Bill trigger right here. So let's go attack and take out Beta Ray Bill. Or take out Sinyaka. Which will stun me. But we get to remove two threat from here. Okay, we're going to throw Clarity of Purpose. We'll take a damage to play Comms Implant on Rocket. Plus one hit points and plus one thwart. Guardians of the Galaxy triggers to draw us into Groot. Flash stepping on a number of symbiotes. What could go wrong? <laughs> Do it. I, I I mean, it does say it, it helps a lot, actually. Symbiotes, I think, is actually the play. Because it gives us the hit points that we need to not roll down. We're fairly set up. I think symbiotes the play. We'll take a damage. We'll drop symbiote suit. On the table. Plus 10 hit points. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Plus 1 to all of our stats. And a hazard. This is going to be the downfall. Welcome to the extra dark side. Woohoo! Let's go! Let's do it. Okay, multi gun. Knock the tough. Um, Rocket will thwart for three off of lashing out. Gamora will attack for two, three, four. Five on Venom. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, one, two, three, four, five. We're going to put that on the belt tower and flip it. So now we increase the damage Venom takes by one. And using the previous ruling, that is the card controller. So that would be him, not. When Venom's attack would deal any amount of damage. Okay, so it's not take. Oh, that's that's annoying. Oh well, here we are. Interesting. Okay, so you can't. Cool. Okay, we could discard until we get an event. I don't see the benefit there, so let's just go ahead and stand up. We need a damage on Gamora though. I could just imagine Flash putting on an extra symbiote suit to a tie-in hat. <laughs> it's a very thick suit now. <laughs> Has more than 20 cards in play. We are fairly set up. <laughs> what I meant by that is we had we had control of the board. In terms of like Venom. Doing Venom things. Got strength call for backup grasping tendrils energy. Okay, 
Oh, here we go. This is take down as well. No, he didn't take any damage. We'll add two. We're going to get attacked. We'll take a card draw, which is locked and loaded. And we will take a three plus a boost card, which we'll just take to the face. Yeah, plus two. That'll flip the bell tower. We got two encounter cards and an acceleration icon. <sighs> okay. Does the symbiotes who bond with the other symbiotes, or are they bonded to flash now? Hmm. Why not both? Okay. Venom is stunned, which is annoying. We do have a running gun. I think we can look at this and we can... Well, let's see what we draw. But, like, I think... Okay. First card is Struggle for Control. We can flip to Alter to Exhaust Flash, take two damage, discard this obligation, or put one... Uh, yeah, we'll do that. We'll Exhaust and take two. Then we got Zeal for the Cause. Resolve the win defeated ability of each Acolyte minion engaged with you. If you're not engaged with an Acolyte minion, discard cards until you get an Acolyte and reveal it. There goes Shadow of the Past again. That's nice. Unison. Unison again. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Mansion will draw us a card. It's another running gun. Oh, here we go. Well, that's exciting. Um, Rebirth is going to draw us a card. Just another running gun. I'm I. That's fun. That's pretty exciting. Um, <laughs> yeah, sick. You know what to do. What is this board? <laughs> right. Uh, okay, let's flip up to Venom. Okay, what's our what's our what's our easiest path to three counters on the bell tower? I think it's Beta Ray Bill, right? Gamora's five, Beta Ray Bill is four. Multi gun is two, which is not enough. But we could multi gun, we could multi gun two there, run and gun to stand up, and then multi gun again. That's probably the best. Multi gun for two here. We're going to have so many boost cards. This is this is pretty close to the monthly challenge in the Discord right now. So Acolytes are just always seeking attention, wanting to be in the spotlight, it seems. That's true. <laughs> okay, let's use Strength and Locked and Loaded to play Run and Gun. So we get to ready Venom in all of our weapons. Multi-Gun, we'll hit here for two. And we'll flip this to Ringing. So now Venom's increased his the amount of damage he takes by one. I am stunned, which is annoying. Which is very annoying. We'll attack to remove the stun. Beta Ray Bill will attack for... That will... No, he gets plus one hit point. Never mind, we're good. Uh, we'll attack for... Five to Venom. One, two, three, four, five. Gamora will attack for two, three, four, five to Venom. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll discard until we get an event, which is welcome aboard. Okay. Rocket has comms in plan. Do we have a... We don't have anything for Rocket. So, actually... What what do we want out there? Is there an ally we want out there? 
Don't forget Venom's extra boost cards. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. So that's been what two? Yeah, I'm 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 hoping to not use the boost. That's that's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> um, we don't have any attachments. Side, side scheme is gone. Thank you. Good call. That's one of those responses that I just completely forget about. So Venom's at seven. Which is like, if we go multi, this is from each attack, right? No, increase all damage. So we can attack for three, five, six. I'm trying to figure out how to... I guess Rocket can hit him for two. I'm trying to optimize the damage. Um, Rocket does two. Savage Attack does enough. Yeah, I think that's what we have to do. Or can we take out Unison? Because we may not actually be able to survive. Or we may not be able to go full lethal here. Um, this is gone too, by the way. Size scheme. Uh, yeah, there are so many responses. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um... Okay, this is... Okay, let's Clarity of Purpose, take a damage to play Call for Backup. Rocket's going to thwart Call for Backup. We're going to go get an ally. Which is... Going to be Groot, I think. Yeah. Groot can do three. Multigun can do three. Do I have a four? Do I have... Multi-done does... I'm just trying to... Mm, it's not It's not being optimized. And he's going to be tough, actually, isn't he? So that's too bad. Um, let's go ahead and just... Uh, ooh. Let's go ahead and have Groot knock out... Knock the tough. No, I don't want to give... I don't want to give Venom a tough status card. But we can when we flip. Okay, so Groot will attack for two, or three. One, two, three. He'll take two. Puts him at four. The math just isn't working that well. We got two... We'll just... We do have two running guns. Okay, we have two running guns. Let's go energy and savage attack to play running gun to ready venom and all of our guns. We will... Venom's at four. So let's just attack for three, four. Which will knock him here. He comes in with 20. And retaliate one, steady and toughness. Retaliate one is actually kind of sucks here. <laughs> and tough. Multigun will knock the tough. We will use our ability to take a damage. Grasping tendrils welcome aboard to running gun. We didn't even get close to knocking him out, but here we are. Multigun will hit him for three. One, two, three. Then we will attack for three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's what, two? That takes him to 11. And we hope for the best. Stand up. I think we lose here. 
Uh, venom stuff. What do we got? Power leadership? Two retaliate. Yes, thank you. Uh, just one. Multi guns not an attack, but thank you. Yes. Good catch. But I did knock him. I, I When I knocked him into stage two, I should have taken the retaliate. Good call, Leroy. Yep. I'm at six health. Yikes. Got power leadership. Savage attack. Give me one of those cancels. Hey, thanks for the follow. Thank you. There's four. Blaze of glory. There, That's lethal, at least. Strength. Go two. Venom's attacking. We'll block with rocket. So it's going to be three. Shuffle each acolyte minion. There is no acolyte minion. Nice. Enraged symbiote into play. Six. Nine. Enraged symbiote into play. Eleven. No overkill. That's nice. We have to we have to block one of these, which I think is still fine. Yeah, I think we'll still be fine. Oh, we can block one with Groot, and we'll take. I don't want to take two damage. Um. One, two, three, four. I think we have to risk it. Take two cards in advance. Scheming for two. That's game. We we're so close. We we're so close. The advance. The assault. The assault we probably would have been fine. But the advance scheming for five. No. Ah, that was that was close. We 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 had it though. I mean, like if, if we did not draw the advance, we we were fine. Because Blaze of Glory. Yeah. Now we cry. No, now we do another giveaway. So if you have not entered the giveaway, make sure that you do so before. I'm going to go to the Be Right Back screen. We're going to come back. We're going to spin the wheel until someone not on the stream wins. So don't go anywhere. The perfect amount of threat to just eat. Yeah, right? Right? Ah, so close. So close. Mm. That was a three boost on the advance. It was tough. It was, yeah, that's just tough. It's just tough. Uh, beans. My new that's my new favorite swear is just beans. Cool. Alrighty. Join the giveaway. I'll see you all very, very, very soon. Peace. <laughs>